Good afternoon, I am Gian Winnie Erdino and for this afternoon, I am going to perform a return demonstration on nasal uh, medication administration. So this utilizes uh, this uh, administration, utilizes the nasal route or through the nose. So usually um, this is to uh, reduce uh, congestion of the, of the nose to help the patient uh, breathe uh, more efficiently. So usual uh, medications to be administered in this route are decongestants. So we're going to proceed right away. So we're going to uh, um, check. Uh, we're going to check um, what uh, sinus what sinus is heavily affected. Um, what sinus is heavily affected? So by checking the medical record, uh, we're going to see um, we're going to see what uh, sinus is heavily affected. So assuming that in here is the uh, statement that says the ethmoid uh, sinus is heavily affected so we're going to assume that the ethmoid sinus is uh, the one that we are treating uh, today so that will uh, determining the which sinus is heavily affected um, will vary or will alter or vary how we um, position the patient's head so we'll tackle that later so Right now, we're going to see any contraindications, so such as uh, we're going to assess the medical history of the patient, such as uh, any uh, hypertension, uh, heart disease, also diabetes mellitus, and also uh, hyperthyroidism, and also uh, rhinoplasty. So, for rhinoplasty, uh, again, as well, uh, this. Uh, this is contraindicated because this is the surgery of the nose. It might, um, by administering medication through the nose while the patient had a rhinoplasty, will um, will cause um, a delay, delay of healing of the uh, surgery. While for the other four, which is high, uh, hypertension, heart disease, um, diabetes, mellitus, and also um, Hyperthyroidism, um, decongestants usually um, trigger the central nervous system, which um, which help dilate the uh, passageway of the nostrils or or the nose. So after that, we're going to identify the client. So, may hapon ma. Sige, so kinsa ni to to ang alan? Um, Claire na. Okay, so Ma'am Claire. Um, ako din ang nurse na guessan niya mo ron, si Gian Dino. So, karong hapon na ma'am, um, naka-idea sa itong button ron. Okay, so karong hapon na, patumaron, tingaw tambal, pero paagi sa yung mga ang ilong. So, naan ako diri is um, decongestant. So, may lang akong consent if okay ra ba ni mo, mag-proceed ani. Okay. Okay, so, thank you ma'am. So, kaling decongestant ma'am, mo niya siya makapatabang o para padako sa or pawalag hubag sa alagyan na to sa ilong kay congested man naman diri si mga record na congested mga sinuses so before ta before ti kaoy administer og um uh, tambal man i-check lang nako imong hang sinuses and also um check lang inspect lang nako imong ilong okay sige so we're going to wash our hands first After washing, okay. So after washing, we're going to inspect the patient's um, passageway, uh, no, uh, nose passageway, with a pen light. Walang tanahon mong ha. Anong nako ha? Okay. Hubag yung mukhang sinus na rin. Okay. Medyo hubag. Okay. So, parang ma'am, ako lang i-palpate yung mukhang sinuses. Ako na i-feel around ha. Okay. Medyo hubag na rin. Okay. So, Upon palpating, no, so I felt the 
assuming that the assuming that the patient had a had an had an inflamed uh, ethnoid um, ethnoid sinus. So we're going to expect that um, there is a um, inflammation here. So upon palpating um, this area, um, we're going to expect that the uh, the sinuses are palpable and inflamed. So upon uh, palpation, uh, what we're going to do after is uh, we are now um, ready to administer but um, first we're going to gather all the materials uh, this is a nasal spray uh, myconase um, we also have here our tissue our medication dropper and in case uh, our gloves so before uh, we are now ready, but before anything else, we can let the patient um, uh, blow her nose first to help uh, the medication um, absorb uh, easily and efficiently. So, Karen, ma'am, na tay tissue, ma'am, gana kamo blow sa mga ilong. Okay, blow lang nato, ha? Okay, thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Okay. So we are now uh, ready to Okay, so we are now ready to administer. We have here the medication, also the dropper. So we're going to Okay. So we have now the uh, medication here. What we're going to do is help the uh, patient. Um, uh, Dad, ni text ko naga film me. Kena kung gusto. Kena. Kapa kapa. Yawa, hindi mong pasensya dito. Hey, pa So we have here our. So we have here our medication. We also have here our medication dropper. We're going to get a uh, medication here. Okay. So after that, we're going to uh, let the patient um, position in a way that we can access the sinuses. So when we want to access the uh, posterior pharynx we let the patient tilt her head backwards or basically hyperextend but since the patient has a inflamed has an inflamed uh, ethmoid sinuses has inflamed uh, ethmoid sinuses we're going to let the patient let the pillow rest under her shoulders and let the let her head uh, hang over while we support it so like this so palayong na kung isa ma'am Okay, lang ha. Okay, da. Okay, ano? So we are now ready to treat the patient or administer the medication. However, for the uh, for if we want to treat the frontal and maxillary uh, uh, maxillary sinuses, we can tilt the uh, patient's head sideways. So like this. And drop it into the um, bone of the nose. So, something like that. So, we're going to treat uh, the ethnoid sinuses of the patient. So, one half inch uh, near the nares. So, ako na ipatulo ng ha. Breathe through the, your mouth, okay? Okay. Okay. So, okay, maintain na tayo in 5 minutes, okay, 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 so, ginawa na lang sa itong baklo mo ha, para ma-observe, huwag tarong ha, okay, okay, so, 
So what we want to do is also um, after administering after administering uh, we can um, clear or clean the patient's nose if the patient has runny nose after administering the medication. So Okay. So assuming five minutes has have already passed, we can now assist the patient back to a comfortable position. So pinin na kami sa mam. Alang sa hinda na balik. So after um after um, assessing the patient in a comfortable position, we can dispose the materials that we have used. So after disposing, we can now um, we can observe the effects of the uh, medication on the patient within uh, fifteen to thirty minutes. So we should expect the decongestant to work within that time range. So assuming 15 to 30 minutes have passed, we're going to um, inspect the um, or assess the patient's um, ability to breathe um, to, be, to breathe through the nose again. So karen ma'am, piagi naman ang 15 minutos. Ang ginawa na kagamit sa imuhang ilong? Arang-arang na? Okay, so karen ma'am, ako i-assess imuhang ilong. Ano Okay. 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 Um, tambang lang ako ma'am if mag-apply kag decongestant. Um, dili na to pasulabihan kay if pasulabihan na to tendency is um, pwede ta maka-develop o sakit or if na magalit kay sakit daan um, mas mo grabe siya, mas ma agra ag grabya do, mas agrabyado yung samot. So Kaneng decongestant, uh, gamitong na nato ni siya if kanang kailangan na jud or if maglisa na jud ka ginhawa gamit sa ilong. So, uh, mao na to siya mang ganahang um, kasabot na paon sa pag uh, install or pag tambas ang pagalingon. Sige, so, ako'y dropper dere. Pwede ni mo ma-demonstrate or? Nani, sulit. Ito na ako na. Okay, so na okay na siya ma'am. Ano ano? Tulong. Okay, so ano tayo siya ma'am? Mas malaki ako ipag-if. Kani may gahubag, Um, pabitay na yung ulo ha, like um behind ba ani or kaning sa flat surface pabitay mo ulo and then uh one half inch against imo nostrils, na? Then, usa katulo, usa katulo, ana lang, okay? Mm -hmm. And then, um, mo lang pa siya, ma'am. So, makaginawa na agtarong? Oh. Okay. So, thank you kayo, ma'am. So, for that uh, procedure, um, we're going, after everything, we're going to record um, what we have done. We'll check if there are any um, side effects or any adverse effects and we'll notify the physician if there are any. And also, administer... Uh, the procedure that you have done. So that is it for my attend demonstration on nasal, uh, uh, nasal um, medication administration. Thank you for watching.